you this season that allowed you to get to this all-star? Yeah, I think uh, just playing with uh, with more confidence. Uh, we're having fun as uh, as a group of guys, and you know we try to make each other better. And uh, you know we we love coming to the rink and, and work hard together. So, you know I think just uh, you know team team success that's definitely helped me. And uh, you know just kind of the mindset to just uh, you know not worrying too much, just trying to you know uh, don't overthink the game and just go out there and play play with confidence. Um, no, I think uh, I'm a guy that always uh, puts pressure on myself. Uh, I want to be the best uh, version of myself every day, and, and you know, be the best player I can be for, for the team. So I uh, always have that pressure for myself. And uh, no, I don't think uh, you know we got we got a lot of good leaders on our team, and uh, yeah, so it makes it makes it easier for everybody. Roman spoke a little bit about Swiss hockey and how you, know, you guys being out here is a good representation of Switzerland and its development of hockey. 100%. Uh, uh, I think having two guys here and just kind of the way we've uh, we've come uh, with the Swiss hockey, it's uh, you know I'm, I'm definitely proud to be here and and, and kind of represent uh, the country with with Roman and uh, you know we've taken some steps in the right direction in in the Swiss hockey and the youth as well. So uh, it's great great to see that and and I jo enjoy you know going back every time and you know when there's a world championship or whatever to kind of. Yeah, play for play for your country, and uh, yeah, just kind of be a you know a little bit of an idol back home. I'm Swiss, not Swedish. <laughs> it's okay. It happens a lot that they mix up Sweden and Switzerland. Yeah, it's uh, it's definitely one of the guys. Uh, uh, when I was younger, I was watching uh, highlight videos on on YouTube and going out to practice and and, and try to do the same stuff. So uh, you know, once when you play against him in the NHL and, and being here, uh, I think obviously not here with with COVID, but uh, facing those guys that you've watched as a kid, some of them uh, playing against them and, and compete, it's uh, yeah, it's a dream come true, and I I enjoy it every time. Yes. <laughs> I don't think so, but uh, yeah, we'll see. We'll see how hard my shot is. Uh, I'm not sure uh, how I can compete with with Chara, but I'm gonna try to just shoot it as hard as I can, and just hopefully don't uh, miss the net. 100 percent, 100, 100, 100 flex. Sorry. Yeah. Ask you about one of your former teammates, Joe Pavelski, later stages of his career, but it seems like he's as productive as ever uh, in Dallas now. What has impressed you about him, and why do you think that he's able to continue to be dominant in his later 30s? Yeah, he's just an uh, uh, absolute great teammate, first of all. And, you know, he's, he's, he's been the captain uh, for us Sharks, and, and now in Dallas, uh, he's, he's just kind of you know, helped me as as a player to grow to uh, when I came in first uh, with the Sharks, and you know, kind of took me under his wing and gave me some advice. Uh, but on the ice, he's just super smart player. Uh, he knows where to get, what areas to get to to, to score goals. But he's also, you know, he plays all three zones uh, really well. So he's uh, he's a uh, is a valuable player uh, for for a team. And uh, yeah, so it was nice to be on the same team with him and and kind of learn some. Stuff, uh, especially around the net, where he's, uh, you know, probably one of the best in the league for sure. Yeah, it's uh, it's been a little bit of a roller coaster, but uh, you know, it's it's kind of the process. Uh, I'm trying to. You know, become a, a better player every day, and and you know, there's going to be ups and downs, and you know, being here, I think it's uh, for me, it's it's very special. So I'm gonna try to you know enjoy it, and uh, but yeah, it always needs a team, and it's a it's a team sport, so you try to you know enjoy those uh, individual uh, moments you get, but uh, you know, then it's uh, it's it's a, it's a team game, and you know, I'm uh, I'm gonna be excited to look at the stretch ahead we have coming. And then, uh, if, if everything goes well, you know, you get, you get 
I don't know. I can't promise anything, but like I said, I'm gonna try as hard as I can, and uh, we we'll see. We we'll see how fast that is. You have a Super Bowl pick. I know you're a Niners guy. And they're out, but where you from? Or we can still win Cincinnati or the Rams? Yeah, a little, a little uh, disappointed, obviously, that the 49ers aren't uh, in the Super Bowl, but. Uh, I don't know too much about uh, those two teams, and uh, I'm, I'm, I'm sure that it's going to be a good game.